You bring your panties right up to the stage to deliver them right to us. If you have some. You, <laughs> it's always funny to see how entitled the audience is. Like, hey man, we paid them for, for the ticket. I want to just yell out every single song in the catalog. <laughs> you know, we look hey, Panties and scarves. This is going to be a beautiful moment. <laughs> Here, Joe. <laughs> All right. Here's the deal. We do have a set list that we're going to be referring to. <laughs> it's called a plan. Uh, and uh, but first. Uh, Somebody did yell out earlier they wanted to hear a Van Halen story, and this is the portion of the show where I'm going to tell a Van Halen story. Now, whether or not you will enjoy this is up to you, but um, <laughs> the, the, the whole thing that I was talking about before, I had to start changing how I played in order to play Frank's music. But as a kid, when I was inspired to play guitar, I really liked Frank's music, I was really inspired by it, but it just seemed impossible. It seemed like there was no way that I could do what he did on the guitar right when it was starting. So I said, I'm going to start with something easier, like Van Halen, <laughs> which is not easy. <laughs> but, you know, it just it was something that stuck in my head. I was like, oh, i got to make that sound. So, you know, I, I sat there and I tried to learn this stuff. You know, I, I was 12 years old. I'd been playing guitar for like five or six months. And that's really, really early in guitar playing, in case you didn't know. And, uh, and to, to attempt to play Eruption at that stage of guitar playing is also a ridiculous idea, but that's where I started. Uh, and so, anyway, we get a phone call that uh, there's a guy on the phone that says he's Eddie Van Halen. And this is the greatest thing that could possibly happen. At 12 years old, I'm playing, I'm learning this stuff at home, and some guy is calling and saying he's Eddie Van Halen. This is genius. So uh, my mom says, hey, listen on the other end of the phone and, and tell me if you think it's him. As if I would be able to tell somehow, magically. But I was, I, I, I wanted it to be him so bad that I was like, oh yeah, it's definitely him, gotta be him. So 20 minutes later, you know, uh, well he actually gets on the phone with my dad and then 20 minutes later, he shows up at the house. So here's Eddie Van Halen in his women and children first jumpsuit showing up at the house and he's got a guitar with him, a brand new purple Kramer guitar because that's right when he was starting to endorse Kramer guitars. And, you know, he walks in and it, it, might, have, it might as well have been like a, a superhero walking into the house, you know, and, and I, I, it, as I saw it, he had the smoke and the backlighting and the Van Halen logo behind him, you know. <laughs> Um, but anyway, as, as he gets in, in, into the studio, I very politely uh, asked him to play everything. Uh, Eruption, Mean Street intro, you know, Unchained, every, every single thing. And, and he, he sat there and he, he went through all these things. And that was burned into my mind. It was very helpful to see that uh, as, as a kid uh, up close. And then, you know, my dad also had Steve Vai in his band at the time. So imagine this, Steve Vai comes over. And this guitar, this purple guitar is being passed around in a circle and they're all playing it and I'm playing on it. Uh, and uh, I had a baseball game the next morning uh, and it got to be like four in the morning and this guitar playing stuff was still going on. And that was pretty much at the time when I said, fuck baseball. You know? <laughs> and I was all into guitar at that point, from that point forward. Um, yeah, so anyway. The whole purpose of sharing this kind of story with you is that, you know, in, in preparing for all this stuff, you know, I, I sort of also like to remember what it was like before I learned all that stuff. So I, I went all the way back to the roots, to what, what really got me hooked on guitar. And, and uh, you know, eruption <laughs> is one of those things. And I, I thought it might be fun as a summertime thing, a little rocky teenage combo thing if we play a little eruption for you tonight. <laughs> 